DJ Khaled has teamed up with Mentos for the Sam Has Mentos Gum campaign, and he invited our friend Andrew Foy to his house to get the scoop. I am here with the man. Yes. DJ Khaled. What's up, man? Hey, Yo, man. Everything good? Yeah. First of all, your house is very oh, nice. Thank you, thank you. A lot of hard work, um, you know, dreams and hard work, you know what I'm saying? When you set goals, they come true. Um, so uh, let's talk about Mentos Gum. I mean, tell, yeah. tell us about your partnership with them. Well, Mentos Gum, I was excited when they reached out to me because I'm already a fan of Mentos Gum. I use Mentos, I chew Mentos Gum. His breath smells good. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> um, and I just love this challenge they have Sam from Wisconsin University where he has to give away 43,000 bottles of Mentos Gum. When he accomplished the challenge, um, I get to come to the University of Wisconsin to praise him, congratulate him, and also perform for all the fans. So I, it's like, who wouldn't, who wouldn't want to give away gum and to get to see a great show. You've worked with some of the greats. Yes. I wanted to do a little word association game with you. So I'm going to say some people that you know have worked with, and you tell me the first thing that pops in your head. Okay. Rihanna. She's amazing, inspiring, beautiful, incredible artist. Jay-Z. My brother, my friend, um, also my manager, and somebody I really look up to. The Beeps. I'm, I call him the Beebs because I think I know him. Good man, very talented, incredible artist, and a good heart. I'm mildly blinded by your watch right now. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank <laughs> you. Um, um, talk to me about, like, who's a, a collaboration that you'd like to do with, that we might be surprised by? Adele. I would love to work with Adele. You know what I'm saying? I think that would be something nobody would expect. You know what I'm saying? So if we can make it happen, I'm ready. So, okay, now, I know you've overcome your fear of flying. So, first of all, congratulations. Thank you. Do you have a fear now of flying coach? Oh, no. I, uh, um, you know, <laughs> I probably would have a fear of flying coach, but, you know, there's nothing wrong with flying coach. There's a lot of reasons why I didn't fly, um, but, you know, I get claustrophobic, so if I don't have to fly coach, you know, but if you fly coach, there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Give thanks for everybody for the opportunity to be able to travel, and, you know what I'm saying, if you get first class of coach, God bless, you know? Just wrapping it up, how has being a father inspired you? How has it changed your life? Everything's for my son. You know what I'm saying? It ain't about me. It's about my son and my family. And um, I'm just grateful for, for God blessing me. You know what I'm saying? It's my biggest blessing.